Seven already, seven and like uh, seven out of ten on what's we saying. Enough, no more. Any sign? This is cool. Those old music. Harasaki, Harasaki, Harasaki. I have to play a lot of Shenmue 1 in, on a Dreamcast. I'm, I'm going to replay Shenmue 1 on Dreamcast again. Just to, just to play the Japanese version. Also, because I have I have both the Japanese version of Shenmue 1 and Shenmue 2, I can, can carry my save over from Shenmue 1 to Shenmue 2. So it's, it's uh, advantageous. It's, it's how the game was intended to be played. It just it never got to be played that way because Sega got to be assholes and sold us out to stinking Microsoft. Bernie Storlor sold us out. Peter Moore, that bastard Peter Moore, wanted a job at Microsoft. So he sold out Shenmue and destroyed Shenmue 2 by making it only on stinking flop Xbox. So we never got Shenmue 2 on Dreamcast like we were supposed to in America. And everybody else, which makes no sense because Europe got it. And how Europe and Japan gets a game we don't get. It's bullshit, man. That was a stupid fucking deal. And it didn't help Shenmue, and it didn't help Xbox one iota. It just fucked up Shenmue, it fucked it up, and, and made a lot of people not buy it on Dreamcast, and made the Dreamcast go away faster. And it shouldn't have happened, there should be checks and balances. It's one, one idiot, Peter Moore, ruined the whole the $70 million franchise, you let him ruin it by putting it on Xbox. They didn't invest $70 million in Shenmue to put it on damn Xbox in the wrong console when it's time to bring out a sequel. What kind of investment is that? I got a chai figure. I'm gonna get the regular ones. There, there are regular ones of these, um, you know, it, oh, that were from the um, the eBay. I mean, the uh, Kickstarter campaign, right? So they were the Kickstarter campaign. Ah, oh, I got Rio on a forklift. That's good. That's rare. Now, um, yeah, I, I got what's the name? I got um, Shenwa, you know. But I'm gonna get the rest of them. You can, you can pay like seventy dollars and get one now. Before they was trying to sell them for three hundred for uh, the set and stuff, six hundred for the set. But now they went calm down with the prices. And you can actually get some, you know? So I'm gonna get all five. We got Ryu with the on this forklift, Ryu on the regular foot, and Lion D. You know? Yo, I was I mean I spent like ninety dollars just now on this. I hope it wasn't nine hundred. I think it was closer to nine hundred. I had nineteen hundred dollars. Let me stop. Cancel. But yeah, this is the one you wanna get. I'll buy a couple more just to finish with my thought. Um, basically, they still have capsule toys, capsule vending machines in Japan. You know, to this day, in 2022, you think those are went away from the 80s? No, they still have them. But they have them now with all kinds of crazy shit, like sex toys and lingerie, anything you think of. Enemy girls. So you, you can get vending machines. So I'm going to go to Japan. I'm, I got another wheel and a forklift. Wow, that's good. That's good odds. But yeah, I'm, when I go to Japan, uh, probably next summer, I'm definitely gonna get some vending machine stuff, just to do Shen, the Shenmue thing. All right, I'm done. I'm done talking about this. You know, capital toys. What I will say is about Shenmue the animation. I did like Shenmue animation. Of course, I like season two better than season one. But the only thing that bothered me about season one, other uh, than it was too slow, the part about Yokosuka, was Nozomi didn't look like Nozomi. She looked too Caucasian. That's what I didn't like about it. I didn't mention that before in my other, you know, um, the other clip because I forgot. Basically, yeah, she didn't even look like Nozomi. But she made her look Asian, like she looked in the game. And it would be way better because she was iconic. It was like the peak of Dreamcast technology, of facial technology. And the expression she made was like her emotions. You could see her emotions in her face. So they said, yes, they should have left her Asian. They didn't have to make her English. Why didn't help us at all making her British? Well, she wasn't British, but they made her look Caucasian, okay? You know, a lot of enemy characters look American or Caucasian and they're Japanese. Well, she's Japanese. She should look Japanese. She looked Japanese in the game. And also her expressions and acting in that game were awesome. Every time you see her walk away from you, she's like frowning. Like her face is away from him, but the camera sees her face when she walks away. And she's sad. She's always trying to be happy for him, but every time she walks away, she's sad because he always lets her down. You know, and that, that part was kind of not really shown in the um, in the semi the anime to the much to a greater degree as it was. It had more time to just drum that point in in the game, and also they should have left her with her damn Asian face. If she's a beautiful Asian girl, should have left her the way she was. All right, I'm done talking about Shenmue animation.